Hello everybody and welcome back to part two of Junimo Kart. Now, I did get to like level four I think it was in Junimo Kart when I tried it the last time. I'm hoping today is the day we beat it, but you know, you never know. We'll see. Alrighty, level one, let's do this. Crumble Cavern. It's doable, it's just, you just have to figure out how far you have to jump? Do you need long jumps? Bunny hops? What do you need? It's 100% doable though. Like that one I just did a bunny hop and that was fine. Normally I would have tried a long jump because there's a big gap. But you have to remember as you're falling down it's going to change as well. I missed the orange. Which... I guess it's okay, but it does mean I miss out on an extra life. It's okay, we got this. We don't need extra lives. We're good. We'll do this without it. Rip. Damn, okay. This bit's a little bit tricky. <clears throat> That's tough, man. Super tough. There we go. Little bunny hop. I will say we definitely are better at it now than we are when we first tried. The very first time I tried this, I'm like, dude, what is this game? This game is not possible. And now it's possible, it's just like super difficult. Okay, that was kind of stupid of me. I think for this winter slope one, you really honestly just want to avoid the ice as much as possible. Because like that, you'll you'll gain too much speed. There we go. Avoid the ice as much as possible. There we go. Popping off. Dang, man. Needed just a little bit more power for that one. It's like small jumps, medium jumps, long jumps, and then there's just there's like tiny little bunny hop. I feel like medium jumps is what I use the most. Like for these ones right here. And there was no way we were making that, bro. That was risky. I did not think we were going to make that. No! We were so close to the end too, bro. Okay. So this is definitely doable. We almost made it to the end of the first run. Well, I say the end. I mean the end of level two, but... It's not bad for a first attempt. Like, the coins are meant to be there to help guide you on how far to jump. But that's difficult. There's really no checkpoints after all that? Okay. Medium jump, another medium jump, again, again, bunny hop. Okay, there we go, first checkpoint. We are down two lives already, which isn't the best. But it's fine. If we can collect all the fruit, we can gain an extra life at the next level. That rock messed us up. There we go. We're just missing the cherry, but we are on our last life, so we have to be spotless here. Which, I mean, it is doable. I just like having the comfort of a life in the case of an oopsie, you know? Sometimes you just need a little bit of insurance. Okay, we made it though. Extra life on round two. You'd love to see that. I would like it if I could save that extra life for 
The next level... Grab the cherry... Those ones, you have to like jump on top of that, otherwise you're gonna crash into it, and that's not good. Okay, little bunny hop on top of that. Jump up these slopes, grab the orange. We're just missing the grape now. So we can get an extra life on the next level. Dude, we got this. It's possible. Here comes the grape. Don't miss it. Okay, so we got the grape, which did give us an extra life, but we also just... Okay, no. What is this? We were doing so good. We got two extra lives, and then we just wasted two there. That's fine. Extra life back. You'll love to see it. Now we go on to the boss. Um, okay, so it's gonna take us to the water boss, which we never did before, I don't think. What the heck happened with that? Okay, I'm really unsure what, like, these bubbles... What am I meant to do with them? These bubbles are very confusing. Like what? We never did this boss before. We had the frog one. Or the slime one, whatever it is. And that wasn't too bad. This one's kind of crazy. I'm not sure, like... Okay. I got popped on a bubble. Please just let us get past this, bro. Some of the bubbles, like, you can jump off of, but some of them hurt you. Not sure how we scammed our way past that one, but we did. That's fine. Continue on. Ghastly Galleon. I think this is where we died before. Okay, come on, Rust. Focus up here. This is just like Crumble Cavern. You can do that. Rip. Okay, so I do think we are going to... Well, definitely if you keep doing that. I think we are going to probably lose on this one. But it's okay. I think... I think if we get the slime boss instead of the whale bubble one... We'll save more lives for this level, and we can do this. We have no extra lives, and we are halfway through the level. Yeah, see, I, I needed full jumps for that. That's fine, that's fine. We got this. Okay, so Crumble Cavern seems easy after, uh, you know, dealing with the ghost one. And I say that I probably will make a mistake just because it happens every time I talk. I'm like, oh, that's not too bad. I talk shit and then, oh, hello. Bro, I really got hit on the head by a rock. Come on with that. It's fine. As long as I get the orange and I keep stacking up lives for the next levels, that's all I really care about. I don't need five lives for this one. I need five lives for the ghost level. Okay, just grab the grapes now. Wait, is the grapes of wrath? They are blocking our path. Okay, shoot. We missed that. That's what I get for singing. I will say we did pass the level. Um... We didn't get that extra life, which we wanted, but it's okay. <clears throat> we don't need 
extra lives on this level. I say that and die right away. I think the trick on this one is to uh, jump onto the slope. This is a bad run. Um, you have to like jump onto the slope, not slide down it, because once you start picking up speed on that ice, it's almost impossible to control, to be honest. Like a bunny hop will send you the same amount that a normal jump would. I'm still going only because I just want to practice. Um, my jumps. But this is not the one we make it, y'all. Here we go. We just need to find the grape. So we can have an extra life. There we go. You know, I can't believe we actually made that. <clears throat> Very nice. Extra life. Okay. Please take us to the slime one. The slime one's not bad. Yes. Yes. The slime one's great. Okay. It's at least more consistent than the bubbles. I say that and die twice. The first time I did the slime level, it did not seem this hard, bro. What the heck is happening? Okay. Okay. I see how this is gonna go. No worries. <clears throat> Let me just save up all my lives for those levels. I need to hit the cherry here. I need to hit the orange and the grape. Here we go. Because if I can have five li lives by the time we get to the boss, we're set. It's not going to work that way, bro. See, you, you even hold for just one second too long, and it's wrapped, bro. That's fine. That's fine. Bad run, we all have some of those, you know? Like... You have to jump on to... Those little stop pillars. I don't know what you want to call them. They're like roadblocks. You have to jump on top of them. So you break them, but they don't stop you. Because if you run head on into them, you just die. Okay. My nose is itchy. This is not a good time for you. My nose to itch, like. Not when I'm in the middle of something like this, bro. That definitely should have hit up on top of this, but that's fine. No extra life. I mean, at this point, we might as well scrap that. Did that go, like. Okay. No, stop itching. Seriously. Okay, focus up. Let's do this. That was bad. I should have jumped to the top. That's my fault. Like, the coins tell you exactly where to go. Okay, I'm focused. I like the mid-jump stretches. When you have the tiny little bunny hops or the long, like, hold and hope. Uh, yeah, that's too difficult. What the heck? That was a long way back. I don't understand the checkpoint system. Because sometimes you'll have two checkpoints that feel like they're right back to back. And then you'll have a long stretch like this. It's like, whoa, bro, what the heck? That was bad. 
I feel like this is my problem with every game. My first attempt is always the best, and then I get consistently worse because I start overthinking things instead of just reacting to it. See, there we go, that's fine, that's all you had to do, bro. All you gotta do is try again. <clears throat> okay, come cavern, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. I'm trying to make it to the boss. I'm trying to make it to the end, bro. See now, if I I could have gotten away if I did a full long jump right there. I just didn't know the rock was gonna be there, which scared me and made me mess up my jumps, bro. Muscle memory, let's go. You love to see it. Orange, thank you. Rip. That's fine, that's fine. It was just a little mistake, it's okay. It's hard to do a full jump and then like a tiny baby bunny hop right after. Okay, we have our extra life for the next level. As long as we can just clear this bit. Perfect, okay. Four lives for the next level. Let's try to make it five. For the boss. Bro, I jumped on top of the... Okay, whatever. It's fine, it's only the beginning. Bunny hops, there we go. Medium jumps. Full send it, medium jump, medium jump, full send it. Medium jump, dang bro. I jumped a little too short on that one. Orange, you love to see it, full send. Mid jumps. Full send, mid, mid. Okay, we're just missing the grape, that's fine. I'm not sure how we gained our life back, but okay. I guess once you get 100 coins, you get your life back. Nice, dude, nice. Okay, give us the slime one. Yep, this one. But just don't be so much bullshit, that's all. Like, this is doable, that's fine. We take this. I don't want to say anything. But so far, this seems like less bullshit than the last time we jumped into this slime level. Full send it, full send it, there we go. Like if you you spend too much time on the slime bro, you're gonna die. I'm trying to just do mid jump. There we go, full send it. We're good. Full send, let's go. That's fine. We got this. Okay. We didn't gain an extra life for, uh... This ghastly galleon, but it's okay. We got this. I don't know if those little blue things that swirl around, like, do they hurt you? Are they just, they're just to distract you? These are things I don't know, but I kind of don't want to test out. We have an extra life just because we got a hundred coins. So we'll try to keep it that way. This is the farthest level I've ever made it to, so... If we can get past this, I'd be pretty happy. Um, 
Aha, uh -huh. so those blue things do kill you. No! That was three stupid deaths right in a row, bro. Full send. They're literally there just to mess up your jumps. Literally there just to be a troll, dude. It's fine, we got this. Yes! We made it past this is the farthest we've ever done. Like, the highest level we've gotten to. And we have an extra life. Okay, which way is it going? Purple Mushroom City. This looks... Dangerous, man. This looks yikes. What the heck? What is this level? This is impossible. Bro. We're not even gonna make it out of the exit gate here. I'm not sure how you're meant to get past this. Alrighty, guys. Well, that's gonna do it. Um, I've been at this for like an hour now. We will definitely come back. We're close. We can make it past the ghost level. We know that. We've done it. I'm not sure what you're supposed to do about those mushrooms. If you guys know, uh, go ahead and leave a comment down below telling me what to do. Because I tried like bunny hopping over them. Didn't work. Tried full send jumping over them. Didn't work. I just kept dying to those mushrooms. So if you guys have tips for that, go ahead and let me know. I will be trying this again soon. And I will see y'all later. Goodbye.